Hey folks, Rob here, and this is the last product I have from Daxus. And, uh, Danny sent me this over to try as well. This is his uh, compact red dot sight. Uh, this one has three different reticles. It has the the uh, circle crosshair dot, the circle with the crosshairs, and then the dot. And uh, the dot is 2 MOA, the circle is 20 MOA. So uh, that's the size of your dot. And uh, inside your box, you get your user's manual, which is pretty simple. Um, this does feature auto on, auto off. You have your lens cleaning cloth, a Allen wrench. You have the sight itself, uh, a little tool for adjusting it, and your low mount. Uh, you, you would use this if you're going to mount it on, say, a 22 or something similar to that. And then you have your rubber straps here. And it's pretty simple. It is shake awake. Uh, the anodization on it looks really nice. Uh, it does have the turrets are covered and they are toolless. You can use the caps to make the adjustments. So you can turn them over and use the cap to make your adjustments with. Or you can use the little included tool here, which has a little screwdriver type on the end of it. And it is audible and tactile. So, yeah, not bad. And... Of course it does tell you up and down and 0.5 MOA per click so half of an MOA per click and this I'll put that cap back on and then we'll take a look at your controls which are pretty simple you have your up and down uh, and the plus also turns the unit on so you would push and hold your plus, and there is your dot, and you can go up in brightness. It must have been as bright as it would go, because it does remember your last. So there's low, there's up. Now in order to change your reticle, you would push the down at button and hold it, and I can't tell if it changed. Oh, yeah, it did. It looks blurry in the camera, but it did change. Let's see if we can get it to focus. You can't tell it by the camera. It still looks like a dot. But that is the uh, circle dot with the crosshair. This thing's going to jump all over the place. Sorry. I have to get a new phone or something here in the future. Let's put this there where we can see it on. And but I know you can't see that through the camera and I can't get it to show. But you hold it again and that is the dot. And then you got the circle dot with the crosshair and then just the circle without the dot. And they all look the same through the camera lens, but believe me, there is a difference. Uh, I wish I could get it to show you what it actually is. Oh, maybe there you can see it. Uh, uh, I'm not doing a very good job of showing this. But anyway, it does have the three different modes. So, like I said, this is a, and this has auto on, auto off. So if you let it set for a few minutes, it will go off. And uh, when you uh, pick it up, it will come back on. The glass is nice and I have my fingerprint on that one. And uh, it's clear glass. Looks like a, a nice little unit. We'll mount this on something and we'll give it a try out here in a, Day or two, you have your battery compartment, comes with the battery pre installed. 
or mine did anyway. So takes a CR2032, which is pretty standard for these things. And it's not very big. Pretty compact. I mean, there it is in the palm of my hand. You can see it's a, a fairly compact unit. Anyway, guys, I appreciate you watching. Not going to make this a big, long video. But this is the Daxison Compact Red Dot Sight with multi-recticles. Uh, shake Awake. Uh, it says... Uh, 2 MOLE red dot with 8 gear brightness, 3 switchable reticle patterns, auto sleep function, shake awake function, and CR2032 long life battery. And there's your 3 reticle patterns. So anyway guys, I do appreciate you watching. And until the next video, we'll see you guys later.